it's your girl Jazz, and as some of you may know, may not know, I don't know, I have another channel where I'm trying to lose weight, get in shape, you know, things like that. But, you know, like most people, it's kind of hard to find good alternatives. So I am reviewing today the Miracle Noodle. It's supposed to be low calorie, low carb, low pretty much everything. <laughs> um, they have three different kinds, at least that I have. They have the angel hair, which I'm reviewing today, the fettuccine, which pretty much looks the exact same, except for it looks a little bit longer, and then these little pebble-looking thingies, which is supposed to be rice. <laughs> so like I said, I'm reviewing the angel hair. Um, I've already kind of started it because I decided to, you know, open it and realize I was hungry, and I'm like, hey, why not review it? <laughs> Last minute, my style. Anyway. Um, as soon as you open it, it has a very fishy smell to it. It's not very strong. And this is coming from somebody that has a very sensitive nose, unless you're sitting there sniffing it. <laughs> it doesn't have very strong of a smell, but, you know, of course, like I said, unless you're sniffing it, you can, you can really smell it. Um, the first step is to, of course, rinse it out, and you get just a bunch of these little noodles. And um, rinse it off with some cool water for about, what says, about 15 seconds. 10 to 15 seconds and then you put in some boiling water uh, for two minutes to kind of I guess get rid of the fishy smell to it it's supposed to absorb any flavors of sauces that you put into it so I'm actually kind of nervous about trying this um, I haven't I've just taken it out of the water so we're gonna go ahead and kind of um, once you take it out of the boiling water you're gonna put it into a let me see uh, dry the noodles by placing them in a non-oil pan on medium heat until it's dry. I guess it's so that way it can give it the more noodle taste to it or the noodle texture that you're used to. So let's get to it. So you're just going to kind of dry it up in the pan for a little bit with medium heat. And as you can tell the difference has a little bit more of a whiter texture to it once it's kind of dried up a little bit. Shouldn't take more than a minute or two to dry it up and obviously kind of clumps up a little bit together if you let it cool down too much because it was a little bit looser just a minute ago. Alright, now let's get our dish together. Alright, as you can see it doesn't really take long to cook the noodles. Maybe five minutes total. And you're probably like wondering, well, what exactly is it? What's in it? Blah, blah, blah. Um, it's actually shirataki pasta is what it's called, or shirataki noodles, same difference, um, just depends on the form. Um, and what's in it, um, this entire package, it, the ingredients is purified water, konjac flour, and calcium hydrate. That's the only thing that's in it. And the calcium hydrate is actually what holds the noodles together to give the form little noodle jellyfish looking thingies. <laughs> Alright, so I'm nervous about trying this. It doesn't have a fishy smell to it anymore, so okay, once you kind of boil it and I guess uh, dry it out, so to speak, um, it gives it, it takes away that smell, so we're going to try it out. Kind of rubbery, a little rubberish. Still has a slight fishy taste to it, which is actually the cone jack itself that you're tasting. Um, but it's supposed to absorb any sauces that you may put on it, so I wanted to try it before and after. And let's try this out. If you're like me, you love tons of marinara sauce. I actually burnt myself on it one time. Not a good idea. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to just take one little noodle that's been dipped in it. Let's try this out. So like I said, it's a little bit rubbery still, but I don't have any fishy smell. It just tastes just like marinara sauce. So if you have a taste for your carbs and your pasta and you still want the low calories, I wouldn't, you know, I'll definitely be eating it again. The downside is it's kind of expensive. Um, what you see on my plate is just one entire bag, so in my opinion, one serving. Okay, so it's supposed to be 
2.3 ounces, which is um, so about a little less than this is supposed to be one serving, but obviously I mean the whole thing, which is zero calories still, so I'm not doing too bad. Um, so about one bag of these is like two bucks. Um, I ordered it on Amazon. I got six bags, which is three of the angel hair, three fettuccine, three rice, and I believe it was about 18 bucks. So I mean it's a bit pricier, but you're always going to pay more for your health if you're watching your calories and carbs and things like that so um i'll definitely be purchasing this again as a good alternative um, because i'm addicted to my carbs and my rice and my noodles so i'll definitely be adding this to my rotation of what am i going to eat today so be sure to like and subscribe um share with all your friends definitely be sure be sure to subscribe because i do have a giveaway so don't forget about that um, once I reach my 100 subscribers, I'll be posting a video for you to comment. And um, until next time, y'all stay jazzy.